the Upper West Side and the Upper East Side are two of the most desirable places to live in NYC. Both neighborhoods are among the most sought-after and wealthiest areas of the city. They are also home to some of the most iconic buildings in NYC. But the most common debate among New Yorkers is which area is better, the Upper East Side or the Upper West Side. Generally speaking, the area that makes up the Upper East Side includes neighborhoods above East 59th Street between Central Park and the East River and below East 96th Street. This area includes the Carnegie Hill, Lenox Hill, and Yorkville neighborhoods. Historically, these are some of the most affluent neighborhoods in NYC. The area is also known for its upscale boutiques and gorgeous architecture. The Upper East Side is home to Museum Mile, a world-renowned collection of museums that line E, 105th and East 82nd Streets. It also includes the Metropolitan Museum of Art and the Guggenheim. The Upper East Side is also known for its architecture. The Upper East Side represents the neo-Gothic style of buildings. Apartments in the Upper East Side, as well as hotels in this part of NYC, are world-class by all standards. The area of NYC north of West 59th Street, between Central Park and the Hudson River, and south of West 110th Street is considered the Upper West Side. Historically, the Upper West Side has been a place where wealthy New Yorkers lived. It's also a culturally rich area. Barnard and Columbia College are located north of the Upper West Side in the Morningside Heights neighborhood. The Lincoln Center lies along its southern border. The Upper West Side is home to the American Museum of Natural History as well as the Beacon Theater. Residential areas make up this area more than retail and commercial spaces. Which neighborhood should I choose? The difference between both neighborhoods of Manhattan includes features like public transit, shopping, schools, restaurants, food markets, museums, and theaters. The Upper East Side is home to the Museum Mile. It also has luxury townhouses, upscale boutiques, and apartment buildings. You would find amenities and culture on the Upper East Side. There's quality education, access to public transportation, and a more laid-back vibe on the Upper West Side. Millennials tend to prefer the Upper West Side for its convenience and access to Lower Manhattan, while senior residents tend to favor the Upper East Side because of its world-renowned restaurants, classic New York vibe, and shopping. On the other hand, the Upper West Side is popular with young professionals. It's home to one of Manhattan's intellectual hubs and is a cultural hot spot. The best thing is that both neighborhoods are great for families due to the number of family-friendly amenities and schools. The Upper West Side has better career opportunities and more fun for adults thanks to its nightlife offerings. The Upper East Side is best for those looking for certain aesthetics and sophistication.